Welcome to Appalachia's Homestead. Patera with you today. We're going to talk about quail. We're moving things all around on the farm and cleaning and getting ready for winter. And it's a good time to talk about your quail and how to make them happy. Here are the two most important things that I have found in my experience to have happy quail. Okay, so the two most important things in my mind that you need to think about besides basic good shelter, food and water, etc., for your quail are these two things. Number one, dust bathing. Do you provide a place for <laughs> Do you provide a place for these critters to dust bathe? They love it. I would argue that the quail probably dust bathe even more than your chickens do. So you might want to think about that because it keeps them busy, it keeps them healthy, and they have a heck of a time. So what I do is I provide a dish, a, a broad and fairly deep little dish for them to get into full of these three things, if possible. Number one, sand. Number two, wood ash. I don't have wood ash right now because we're not working our wood stove yet. I've already used all of it for the year so far. And then a little bit of diatomaceous earth. So you've seen me mix it up with the sand and the DE. I provide a new dish for them a couple of times a week just to freshen it up because they'll kick it out. That's what they do. But it's worth the effort because it keeps them so happy, parasite free, and Frankly, they love to lay their eggs in there. So I can go in on any given day, and if I want to find most of my quail eggs, they're going to be in the dust bathing dish. Okay. The second thing that I find, and you can see that we've got some mating going on with some of these girls, and I've got a little girl over here that's separated. That's Miss Scarlet. I like to provide a natural setting for them, okay? You'll have to change it out once or twice a week. I provide branches, especially if there's leaves. Now, I don't have pine straw. I sometimes like to put a little bit of pine straw in there. Helps to keep the cage clean. Inside of my barn, I let the droppings fall. But out here, since it's a little bit cooler and we're outdoors, I've given them a little bit of bedding. You're going to have to work with it, but they do like it. You will have to change it. No big deal. Quick and easy. Well, hello, Mr. Harvey. <laughs> <laughs> and I also like to give them pine cones just to give a little bit of a natural setting for them. Again, it makes them happy, makes you happy, and that is what we want. <coughs> All right, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to put this inside the cage, and I'm going to let you see what they do. All right, guys, simple as that. Quail are fun. Quail are simple and easy and a great hobby for you to have on the homestead. A lot to learn from, and the children love them. See? Happy home. We'll see you on the next video. Hope you're doing great out there, and thanks for watching.